Hey guys, so I just wanted to give quick context in case you don't know what this means by 100,000 or dev challenge or if you're a zombies person and don't know anything about the Valhalla DLC. So a couple weeks ago, God of War Ragnarok released a free DLC called Valhalla and it just takes the base game's core systems and turns it into a roguelike mode. I want to talk about it more in a zombie specific video later because I have just been loving this mode and they honestly, they killed it. I have about a hundred hours in the DLC alone, but for this specifically on Twitter, a dev challenged the community to do this hard challenge, which is basically do a run of Valhalla on the hardest difficulty with the penalty of breaching, which is, it takes the difficulty and pushes it even one higher. So you're in a difficulty that you can't manually really select. But on top of that, you're also losing health 24 seven the entire time. And then also on top of that, while you're doing an entire Valhalla run, you have to 100% it, which means completing all the side objectives that you come across and the secret boss before you actually go kill the final boss. So enjoy the rest of the video. I'm gonna have some zombie things coming out over the probably the next couple of weeks. And yeah, have, just have fun. Okay, what are we getting here? Oh. Oh, that's really actually good for us. Okay. Both of those are really good. Okay, these aren't good though. Hmm. When you upgrade Tardis Rage, does it get another thing of damage from two to three? Does anyone know? I don't think I've actually tried it out. I'm gonna try it this run. What's the worst that could happen? We got an Echo's door too. So. Going to give yourself an affliction. <sighs> and we're getting Soulless Assault. And it's actually not a bad challenge to go along with it too. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Please game. Please let this one run go somewhere. And we have refresh in the first shot. So we have focus and refresh already. We're getting solace assault for the start of Greece. Oh game. Okay. Please Christmas Kratos. <laughs> Let all of my misfortunes up to this point be for this moment. Bring me great tithings and joy. I do think it's still cool that you can get the black bear pelt to turn green. If you use this specific waste with it. I don't know why it turns green, but... I need to see. You all right, brother? Like, what do you want me to do there, game? You know what I'm saying? 
the timing of this AI right now is impeccable. <laughs> Thankfully, our burden's not a bad one, so taking damage isn't a big deal. Yet. Not afraid of a little give and take, I see. <laughs> Okay, so we already have Solus Assault. Like, we know that's coming. So, I can use my rerolls kind of freely now. That increased healing would be nice, but I'm gonna go ahead and do preemptive. Echo's door, Echo's door, Echo's door, please. Yeah, we got an Echo door. We can continue the run. I just have to really not throw. I kind of went Scorched Blades over the Burned Immolation. Like, Burned Immolation is nice, but... Scorch sweep. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well. That makes me wonder if shops aren't determined until you physically interact with them and not whenever you load into an area. Okay, can we get lucky and get a third Echo's chest? No, but that's fine. We are gonna get a sword challenge though. So that's a bit of a... Ugh. Yeah, that just potential of health for that would be amazing. I'm actually gonna just hard take the, the, the stat store here. I was considering taking the other one because it can it gives you stats too, but okay. What am I hitting? Oh, this is the bird one, isn't it? to that range. Okay, that could have gone better, but 102 echoes. I'll take that. Okay. Fly! 
Oh, don't you get stuck! Come on, please jump up here. Hundred twelve echoes. Okay. Good. Nice. We take those. Mountain splitter. That's worth it. All right, so we only got two Echo Doors. I say only, but I'm still happy with getting two Echo Doors. Should be unlocked. Let's make our way up. So the boss should still be the same, right? Also, I'm going to go ahead and pick this up. Which, it's a pretty easy boss. I should not be afraid. Of course. <laughs> oh. It could have went worse. <laughs> so I'll take it. And we also get, we get an extra glyph. And it's Master of Arms. <sighs> Man, I should have healed up with rage. I, I knew I should have. Okay, but the good news. The good news is we already have Solus Assault. We just have to get a light runic attack. Which we basically want. Um Oh, we gotta get both of these. We basically want Hades. Like, I think Hades is what would pair with Tartarus Rage the most. I should go ahead and get one chunk of health there. But again, we're going to have another sword challenge that we have to deal with. Which 
one yielding to what? Oh my gosh, we got an, an extremely easy one. So we won't throw on the challenge this time. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Also, what is my luck stat at right now? It's higher than normal, but we really need to get our runic damage up. We have extremely low runic stats. I'm back. What a thrill. Can you not be back, Helios? <laughs> You're literally like my bad luck charm right now. <laughs> okay, so we're just going to take this one because it's the least damaging against us. So... Decisions, decisions. Fortune's refresh. Oh my gosh, we have to pick that one up like immediately. Okay. Um. Actually, I think I know how it. I guess it. You know, there's actually probably a better starting route than how I've been doing this. Actually, no, there are a hundred percent is. I guess it's about the same, but, um, okay. Anyway, oh wait, no, there's not a better route because we need to go up top for the runic chest anyway. So doing it how we've been doing it is how we still want to do it anyway. Okay. All right. So. Special blues here. So blue is on right. That's a good one for us. Okay, and yellow is on left. Blue on right, yellow left. Okay, we need runic. Okay, well, <laughs> is this really a hard choice here? Why would I not pick this one? <laughs> like that just seems kind of goofy. Might want to pick up the pace, unless you want everything to get more difficult. Okay, we need to pick up refresh now. Oh, nope, that's the wrong thing. Oh, my glyphs are full already. Really? Oh, wow. Okay. We can get rid of deadly flames. Pick up fortune's refresh in there. Shield 
I mean, I guess I'll take artillery. First we'll be hitting two there here. Just got harder. Did you forget um, a factor here? It's not worth re-rolling these at all, but those are all pretty kind of crap. Okay, we got our challenge done already. So that's good. Two seventy seven. Oh my gosh, aim. <laughs> um, we can stop in the middle for that yellow chest. Yeah, I don't think that's a bad call to do right now. Well, he chose. What do I currently have? Blessed, Fortunes, Preemptive, and Master of Arms. There are some other gold ones that I wouldn't mind getting. But Arcanist Defense probably is the way for me to go here. Let's just, you know, play the safe card. Okay, let's go ahead and get this up as well. Let's go ahead and get Mountain Splitter up too. We finally get a light runic attack. I'm a reroll. Oh, we got Hades. Okay, good. Now we're going to have to deal with level one Hades until we can come back around. Okay, and my reds on the right. A friendly reminder your foes are getting okay. stronger the longer you fiddle around. So blue and red are right, yellow is left. Thank <laughs> you. 
Wow. <laughs> I think that's the cleanest that the boat has ever gone for me. <laughs> I, I think that's by far the cleanest it's ever gone for me. Okay, we want nine realms for sure. Um... I don't know what to get rid of. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I think we can get rid of immolation. For nine realms. We had one really, really good run earlier, Pies. I kind of threw it. <laughs> but we had one really, really good run. Um, but now this one, this one has a very, very good chance at 100K. I just have to not be bad. Simple enough, right? I just have to not be bad. All right, so we need to go over to the desert now. I said my yellow was on the left, right? Deflection wouldn't be terrible. But no. I'm in the Discord pies. For once, human, I'm in there. Like, I signed up with my email in Discord. That went good. Time to face your ultimate foe if you're ready. <laughs> you're not. Um. Mm, 
I can't take that one. I want it. I really do want that. But we're doing so much more runic damage that I'm going to take the safe, the safe throw there. All right, so we got to get our, hit our yellows now. Uh, yeah, we can stop in the middle for this red too. Right, desert, then yellow, yellow. Okay. Always looking for an edge. Is this a? Gate? It's a really good heavy attack, but the only problem is going to be against bosses. Oh, that's going to be like really nice. But yeah, bosses is where it's going to end up coming back to probably bite us the most. Because you get in, you get stuck in such a long animation for it that if you don't time it right, you're going to be getting hit hard. Okay, so we're going to tier three for these ones. Only getting harder as you delay, Kratos. I'll take runic anything that gets my runic up right now is what we want to take hi arc So yeah, yellow, yellow, then blue, yellow. These are all lined up nicely over here for us. Incoming die. Be safe. Mind the tail, you imbecile. Line behind you. Whew. Okay. We keep getting strength and I need runic. Oh. Behind you, watch out. Well, I'm not really sure what you're looking for recommendation wise. Shield strike, do it. Because all you said is you're wanting to buy a, PS, buy a PS5 and play it on there. Like that that's your money. I can't tell you what to do with your money. If you're asking for me if you should buy a PS5 or not. Mm, no, nothing in there that's worth it. Okay, let me come into the middle for a second. All right, so we need to do the reds. Do y'all remember where I said my special red was? Was it on the right or the left? Because I know my yellow is on the left. I think my red's on the right, I think. How long does it take to beat the game? I mean, it depends on what difficulty you want to play it on. I mean, yeah. And then whether it's fun or not, I mean, it's fun for me. I wouldn't be playing it if I didn't have fun. 
But I mean, it's it's possible you load up the game and then you just absolutely hate it. Okay, massive runic damage. <laughs> that was so weird. I don't know why everything was so delayed on that. So tempted. No, I, I gotta play it safe. Like he's got a stun break soon. Oh, I know Breath of the Myrrh. Okay, actually, no, I want that. That's actually not bad. Okay, let me stop in the middle for a second. Please take your sweet, sweet time. Let's upgrade everything. And then I need to see score wise where this compares to my personal PB one run at. So where was that? It was this one? I always get greedy during Okay, that so and I know I shouldn't. I was at 46,028 in my PB at this point in time.
And right now I have 500 more. So, as long as I don't throw, we have enough. Now, to be fair, we have the form and then we still have a rift to do after the form as well. So it's not like this is still just a cakewalk, but. This has a chance. Game. I swear. Can you stop the spamming ranged attacks? Oh, my goodness. Thank you. Like, the one thing I hate about the king is, like, I can have the most dominating build, and then right at the end, he can just immune everything against you, and it just gets horrid for you. It's really stupid. Like, it's really, really stupid. But... Tis what it is. I wouldn't mind getting rid of this, but we still have one more thing that we need to do. So I'm actually, I think I'm just forfeiting this. Yeah, I'm just gonna forfeit this. I just needed to get at least one realm shift back before we went over here. 63,000. That seems really low. No, never mind. That's actually high. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
Incoming! I'm not risking that. that brought down atlas oh i want I, that that's an automatic we have to get that oh that's fine because we can get rid of this now and we can pick this up okay so there's a chance that this is our 100k run there's a chance. I am a little scared about tier yes, with this yes. build. Pick something and let's go. Um, and I say I'm mostly scared just from the fact of, I don't think this is a great stun lock build and stun locking tier is what really, really dominates him. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and buy a resurrection stone even i hate resurrection stones but <laughs> at this point i've already used one might as well just be safe <laughs> you know what i'm saying All right, let's make sure everything's upgraded. It is. Okay. Who knows what tier we're gonna get. I just gotta be smart. No pun intended. Ah, the end of another gauntlet. Oh, you! I, I literally had you last run with these. That's gonna hurt. Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> yes! <laughs> I admit defeat, Kratos. <sighs> and then, all right, so penalty of breaching. Here's everything that I use for this build wise. That was a pretty clean tier. I've got to admit that was incredibly clean. The only thing that I think I got hit on was uh, whenever I was doing the big AOE during the ads phase. And we did do three burdens, but one of my burdens was for uh, was a sword challenge. So that's why there's only two here. So. Ah. Finally. <laughs> a rematch is yours whenever you need one. Good like, I mean, it's again, it's not the highest score, but it's 100k. That's a very hard thing to do. And especially doing it with the dev challenge. And we did it with our Christmas Kratos with our green black bear pelt skin. I'm very, 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 very happy. And if you're curious what I mean about the green thing, the black bear chest will change colors. If you have the girdle of folk Wagner on, and there's another one that makes it like gray. Yeah, the girdle of, however you say that. But, oh my goodness. I am happy that we got our 100K run in finally.